Welcome to Year 9 Season 3 Twin Shells. The battle pass is out. I'm going to have a look at it. I've genuinely not clicked on it yet, and we've also got 19 packs to go through. But also, some of you may not know, somehow I've been lucky enough to be given a charm in game, and it's available right now. If you sub to me on Twitch, uh, it unlocks on you. As long as your Ubisoft account and Twitch account are linked, it will unlock on your Ubisoft account. You can apply it to any guns that you want to. If you want to do that, twitch.tv forward slash a littleton once again can't really believe that it's actually real seems really weird looking at that in game but anyway that's enough of that out of the way let's get into the battle pass um it's changed the layout a little bit hasn't it so um let's start with scopos at the um wait should i do... okay so is, there's normally a skin in that one is there not Yeah, Printer Hazard. Okay, so there's... Two, yeah, they're two different skins for the two different robots. You can see them there. The reason the robots have got two different skins, by the way, is so you know which one you're fighting at any one time. So if you're fighting a robot and then Scopos disappears around the corner and comes back, you know which robot you were just fighting because of the two separate health pools. So, <coughs> excuse me. Right, let's have a look at this. Um, yeah, the two head colors are different, look. So that's for the Scopos robots. Not much to go off there, really, is it? And that's the different headgears. Then we've got a Capitao set, which I can get behind. Although it looks okay. It looks a bit like the membership one that was released. Seashore Clarity, so maybe it's like a nautical type of theme. Um, then we've got Charms. Um, drone. Looks pretty clean. I blend in quite well in a lot of different maps, actually. Pack. Charm. So Grecian themed uh, pack booster pack portrait. It's okay. Probably never going to use it, but it's okay. Then we'll I'll just keep a mental note of where we are. So we've gone down this leg. Then we'll go down this leg. Then we'll go across the top. Um, so as we go up, another pack up. That looks cool. That was 3D effect. I really like that. I can get behind that a lot. Um. Credits. I've got to stop saying erm. Um, it's really bad. Another pack, right? Then Solar Skin. This is the one that looks really cool, right? Let's take a quick screenshot of that because I'll probably chuck that in the thumbnail. Um, so the operator card you saw there, the weapon skin looks okay. I'm not losing me out of the weapon skin. Another booster and the rest of this. <laughs> it looks so cool, man. I really like the skin. The weapon skin, not too keen on, but the actual uniform looks class. Then across the top, we've got Blitz. Blitz's shoulders are massive, man. He's so hench. Headgear. Eh, it's okay. Pack. Credits. Cool. How, how many credits do you get, by the way? You get 120 a go, and you get like one, two, three, four, five. What's that? 120 times five? You get 600 credits across the way. That's not bad, is it, really? I suppose. Um, so we've seen Solus, we've seen Blitz, uh, we've got a ooh, weapon skin, is that Universal? No, it's just for the AK, just for f uh, Ace and Fuse that it shows you there. That's okay. Um, then we, that's the weapon skin across the top, and we've got the Ace weapon uh, uniform here. Again, quite nautical themed, isn't it? Sort of ancient Greece type theme. Headgear, it's not taking over the secret headgear I'm afraid. We got down some mozzie. That's the operator portrait. We've then got the skin. Looks, I like the colours on that. It looks pretty cool. It stands out quite nicely. Look at the little um, crocodiles on a motorbike there. <laughs> I like that. Uh, and the weapon skin for that looks... Uh, headgear looks clean. And the weapon skin is there, which also looks quite clean, actually. That would go really well with that orange attachment skin. Coming down, we've got an operator portrait we looked at before. Char wow, that's a bit creepy, isn't it? Like a Cyclops type thing. Um, park, weapon skin, that has to be universal. Yeah, it is universal. What right, sort of faces on there? It's okay, don't hate it. Uh, park, Kavera will come to the mozzie weapon skin we've seen. Oh, Andrew! Mozzie weapon skin we've seen. Park. What is that? It was an attachment skin. 
just for the TCSG, is that? I got starfish and stuff on. Yeah, it's just for the TCSG. Interesting. I mean, it looks pretty cool. So then this must be the other T. Yes, now we're talking. That's class. Actually, a unique look changes the shape of the weapon slightly. That looks really, really clean. I really like that. Nice job. Really like that. The uniform and, and other weapon skins that go with it. That one's okay. I like the colors on that a lot, actually. I'll probably use that. Something about those blues and the white, and that's like the shore there, and that's the sand. I like that. Yeah, that's clean. Headgear. Portrait. Skin. Mate, that actually goes really well with the headgear that I've got already. I'm probably going to use that. That looks good. I'm definitely using that TCSG skin. That's really smart. Right, across the top now. Credits, pack, Ella skin. It's probably going to be similar to Mozzie. Like a Phoenix, is that, yeah? Headgear. It's okay. Cavera. Ignore the, um, the headgear, obviously. This is just the uniform. Cool that there's like sort of arm paint almost. Weapon looks pretty good. Is that animated? I think that is animated. Yeah, that looks nice. Yeah, it is animated. Nice. The last thing I need is more people to play Kavera, though. Nothing worse is though. Like, I'm adamant she's really easy to counter, and then she, I get countered every game. Portrait matches what we've just seen. And attachment skin. Ignore the silicon gun skin. Attachment skin to go with the animated weapon skin. Across the bottom, credits, pack. Another universal skin. That's not for me, I'm afraid. And we've got... Grim. <laughs> looks funny with the Street Fighter skin on. This looks like it's similar to the Mozzie skin, right? With the, the orange sort of. Yeah, it's the same. Same theme. Take or leave that, to be honest with you. Finca. Okay, that looks pretty snazzy with the feathers. I like this. What's the headgear looking like? Okay, Finca's got some purple lippy on and a, and a blonde hairdo. Get behind that. Ying. This is similar to the Ace skin, I think. It's okay. Weapon skin's pretty clean, to be fair. I don't have many skins at all for this gun. Um, so I can get behind a uh, nice skin for that. And we've got Ella. Charm, which matches the Mozzie skin and the Grim skin. The Ella weapon skin. It's okay. Pack, pack, pack. Drone skin, that's really clean. The only thing is, it just that just won't blend in with the map, and if you're the ultimate ranked sweat like me, you want to you want your drone to blend in the map, really. Um, And we've got a universal attachment skin that's like black on the top and sort of gold underneath. Um, Which is there. Yeah, okay, I like that. And that's a universal, right? Yeah, yeah, that's a universal. I really like that. Yeah, that's nice. So that attachment skin goes with that then, yeah? Yeah. And then we've got a pack, another operator card with some cogs on. Pack, pack. And another, another weapon skin. Is that just for the um, commander? With a B on, so it's green. Yeah, I can say it's Grimm's. Okay, all in all... It's, it's okay, isn't it? I don't mind it. I think that that weapon skin's really clean. I'm going to use that on something. The solar skin's tremendous. The A skin's not too bad. Blitz, I can... That, that style of skin there, the sort of... The one that's on Blitz. The one that's on Mozzie. The one that's on Grim. So I'll take or leave it, to be honest. I, mean, I, don't, I don't dislike it, but it's not my favourite. The Cade skin's really clean. Both weapon skins are really, really good. Especially the TCSG. That looks so good. Um, so the Cade skins are really clean. Ying skin's okay. The weapon skin's nice. Finker skin's cool, especially the uniform with like the sort of feather type things on. I like that. Goes quite well with the Dead by Daylight headgear, actually, to be fair. Um, and some of the universal skins are just a bit all right, aren't they? Like, it's like those upside down Pegasus type things. It's okay. It's like, as far as battle passes go, excuse me, <coughs> it's not the best, but it's not the worst. It's still pretty cool. It's okay. Um, the seasonal skin, is that in the... The Premier Pack is 
um, Solace this season is the seasonal skin bundle in the store. It is. Let's have a look. That looks really nice, doesn't it? Like Greek God on there. Yeah, different each side as well. Nice detail on the grip. Colors pop out. That's well nice. That's your attachment skin. The, the sort of purple, like matte purple. That's really cool. I like that. Operator card of some screens. That obviously falls in line with Scopus. And then the charm of some olives. Really nice weapon skin, though. That seasonal. That'll definitely be getting copped. I think is what you're supposed to say. Look at that on that shotgun. If you go, if you want to see on different weapons, by the way, go onto it, come out of it, go back on it, it'll be on a different gun. Now it's on a UMP, go back out of it, go back in, now it's on the P90, go back out of it, go back in, now it's on Thermite's gun, etc, etc. Synthesis bundle, what's this? This is a weapons skin pack just for Scopos on a new PCX. Okay. Twin shells bundles, this is all the camos for the season. I, th I don't know if we still need to keep doing these. I don't know if anyone actually buys these. I mean, they don't look too bad, but... I think there's enough skins out there now that I'd be interested to see what the number of um, purchases are on that type of skin on those sort of camo bundles then over to the payday bundles so yeah pretty pleased with that I think I'd say get on the packs quickly 19 packs let's get them open not for me that's the uh, last season's camo by the way, just to let you know, my alpha pack look is absolutely shocking. Out of 19 packs here, you'll probably see maybe three purples or gold, if that. So I hope you're all ready for the new season. Like I say, don't forget the charms out, which... I don't think I'm going to get over saying that. I'm sorry, boys. I'm going to be quite boring for a while going, Oh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. But I genuinely can't. Sterile soil. Yeah, that's right. Oh, second purple. Duplicates, love that. Oh, I think I already own that. Yeah, I do. It's a really cool skin, though. Is there anything new have been added to the Alpha Packs and Bravo Packs, actually? Let's have a quick look at that afterwards. So we've had two purples and a gold, three purples and a gold out of 19. I don't recognize that. Although that's not to say it's new. I can't say I'm up for speed with my Blackbeard skins. Oh, I just thought. New things being added to the Siege Marketplace. Hmm, I'll check that. Maybe I'll do another video on that. Keep your eyes peeled on that. Um, so what have we had? Three purples and a gold out of 19 so far. Last one will be a gold anyway. Not this one, next one. This one now, ready. Sound, love that. Love that for me. <laughs> Stay at Goyo, man. Um... Not got a bra. So let me just check the Brava collection. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, all these were in there last season. I don't think there's been anything added new there. Um, maybe some of those are new. Maybe I think they're from all battle passes. I think. Uh, that might be new. No, that's not new. Um. All your black ices, and down into the more common skins. Yeah, I don't think anything's been added there. Charms. Okay. Well, there you go. That's the Year 9 Season 3 Battle Pass. I don't know what you think of it. I think it's okay. Um, where's the pictures? Scopo skin. Go oh, sorry, Solar skin really good. Cade skin really good. Cavera skin okay. Finker skin pretty good. Finker skin isn't on the example here, which is a shame. But, yeah, I'm, I think it's okay. You know, get me wrong. I'm not buzzing about it and I'm not like oh, it's the best battle pass we've ever had but it's certainly not the worst I'm looking forward to getting into the season thank you as always if you've got this far for getting involved with the channel don't forget charms out now I'm going to say that all the time and uh, I'll see you next time cheers